everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jessica and today I have my weekly makeup basket for you. I have not gone full ham or full sherry mode this week, but um, I'm, I'm borderline with it this week. I don't have everything in, but I have a lot in. All right, let's get started with this one. I am continuing to use my CoverGirl True Blend face primer for oily skin. No, this isn't in a project. I'm just using it because... You know, I don't have a primer in a project, so that one's in. I am working on my Bare Minerals Matte Foundation. It's a mineral foundation. It's in 2C Medium, and I am also working on a regular mineral veil. And I am working on two different concealers. I have the Wet n Wild Photo Focus in, I think it's light, light ivory, light ivory. And of course the Profusion Conceal Palette. Gotta get my working on that. I'm doing really good with it and I just, I wanna keep that momentum going. All right, blushes. I have two blushes. I have my Elf Candid Coral and I'm, I'm, I'm so close on that one. And I also have my Franken um, blush that is from Maybe Girls' Night? I think it might be from Girls' Night. Um, let's see. For bronzer, it's going to be in my magnetic palette. So let me show you the highlighters first. I put three in. Yep. This is sherry mode right here. I have my um, cream one, the Tristique. And I have, uh, what is this? Gold Gossamer from Bare Minerals. I ended up having to repress this. And um, yeah, I had good pan in the middle of it. And it started to crumble, so I had to repress it. And the blush that isn't a blush, but a highlighter in Got a Glow from e.l.f. I want to work on that one as well. So I should be glistening this week. Maybe. All right. Let's get into the palette, the magnetic palette. There is the Sephora Colorista bronzer that I'm working on. Yes, I know I need to redo my nails, but I'm enjoying the blue. Um... This is Evil Shades 13th Hour. This is from the Sport Colorist palette. Both of these are Bare Minerals. The purple is Angel. This one is Jazz. This is a Coastal Sense Mica pigment in Intergold Sparks. Kaylin Orchid. And this is Bare, not Bare Minerals, um, Coastal Sense Ashen. My brain is Ashen right now. All right. The rest of the eye stuff, I'm going to show you, of course, you know, my primer. It's a couple more weeks. Hopefully, that's all that's left of it. Crossing my fingers. All right, all of the eyeshadow. I've got a lot of eyeshadow here. All right, first one is the Elf Baked Eyeshadow Palette. This is the only one I'm going to open because it doesn't matter. There's no spoiler here. This is my Throwing Shade Palette for the week. So I've got that. I have my Elf Mad for Matte. I have the NYX Sex Bomb Femme Fatale. I'm only working on the matte cream shade in that one. Um, and I have only four of my five quads for Pan That Palette. I have three of the Coastal Scents Sampler Quads and the Elf Eye Transformer Palettes. Yeah, I need to get going on that, that e.l.f. Eye Transformer palette. I need to really make some progress. It's still here. It is the e.l.f. Smudge Pot in Ain't That Sweet. Wish me luck in the next week or two. Maybe. Maybe. Let's hope. Um, eyebrows. I'm still working on the um, e.l.f. Eyebrow Kit in Medium. I'm really enjoying that. And I cannot believe this has not died yet. I, I thought it was going to die last month and... It's still here. The Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel. It just keeps kicking. And, you know, I'm going to use it. I'm going to use it till it's gone. All right, eyeliner. I have four in. Four. I missed this last week. This is the Star Looks Gem Pencil in Amethyst. I love this thing. And, and I really wanted it back. I am going to be using Pacifica Gunmetal. Just the Rockstar half of this Urban Decay 24-7 Glide-On Liner. And I'm keeping in the Makeup Forever Aqua XL in black. 
And for mascara, it's the Color Max Maximum Volume Mascara in Waterproof. And I just whacked my funny bone. That was not very funny. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's going to be okay. Um, yeah, still working on that mascara. It's going to be a while. And I, um, I'm enjoying it. All right, what do we have left? Lips. Lips. Of course we have lips. Keeping it in. Keeping it in. I'm just... I'm just admiring all the pan in there now. Um, so yeah, working on that Avon lipstick adjuster. I've got a few other things in here. I am going to keep in the Nude Sticks Kiss. I do have this on my lips right now along with the Tarte Tartist Lip Paint in Party. I have this on and then this over top of it just so it wasn't so bam in your face. It's a little, a little bright. Um... I've got my Sephora nothing, 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 nothing but nude lip liner. I can't talk. It's, that's what happens when you're filming at almost 11 o'clock at night. Um, I had to bring in a another lip balm. This is just the Blistex Medicated Berry. It's not in any project, but a girl's got to have balm. And the Makeup Forever Artist Rouge C211. That thing is like, it's it's bending. It hasn't broken yet, but I have a feeling now that it's getting a little bit warmer, it's going to. All right, and I am down to the last three lipstick pans from my Sephora Colorista palette. Yes, you know what that means. That's it, those three. All right, that is everything for this basket. Oh, I'm a little, my brain is a little haphazard today. It is. It's been a crazy day. It's been rainy and gross, and uh, which is why you're seeing my hair back a lot lately. It has been so rainy and humid and gross here on the East Coast, and um, your girl got a lot of hair, and it goes, whoosh, and mm -mm. I, it wouldn't fit in the screen if I didn't tie it back right now. That's that's why you're getting this and seeing all the grays coming out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, wrapping this up so I don't keep babbling on and on. Um, let me know what your favorite thing is in your basket for this week or this month. That is the question of the day. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until I see you in my next video, have a beautiful day.